Hi, first grade. Let's work on some math. Let's practice our addition. So here's our first problem. Move numbers to complete the addition equation. So how many blue are there? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we grab the number six. Whoops. Grab the number six. And then how many red? Four. So we take that up here. And then how many all together? Six plus four equals how many? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It equals ten. All right, there we go. And let's do this one. How many red? You're right if you said four. How many blue? You're right if you said six. And our answer is ten. Same as this. Just because you change the order, just because you flip them around, you put the six here or here, the four here and here. In addition, it does not matter. So we got it right. 10. Good job. Let's move on. All right. We have how many? One. Real easy. And how many are here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One plus eight equals how many? Eight, just one more, that's nine. Okay, and how about over here? See, we flipped the blocks over. And now we have how many? We have eight, orange, and then how many yellow? One, and that still equals the same number, right? How many? Nine. Good job. One plus eight equals nine. Eight plus one equals nine. Same thing, doesn't matter because it's addition. All right, let's look at this. 7 plus 0, simple. 7 pieces of candy, you add no more candy, you end up with 7. Good job. So let's break this down. These numbers, what can we do to get, um, we can put 7 plus 0 equals 7, right? Exactly. Okay. 7 plus 0, or we can mix these up. We can put the zero over here, zero plus seven. Doesn't matter, we still get seven. Good job. Find the sum, then change the order of the atoms. Move numbers to complete the new equation. Okay, two plus four, how much? We have two, and we have four, and we add them all together, and we get how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, six. We end up with six. Or we can switch them around. So instead of saying 2 plus 4, we can say what? 4 plus 2 more. We can have 4 in this hand, right? Or 4 in this hand. Doesn't matter. And then 2 more. You add those two and you get how many? It's still 6. That's right. 2 plus 4 or 4 plus 2, same thing, still 6. Okay, let's do this. How much? 8 plus 7. Oh boy, we have 7. And if we had 7 more, we know that would be 14, right? 7 plus 7 is 14. So is 7 plus 8 14? No. We have 14 and then we have one more, right? Because it's not 7 plus 7. It's now 7 plus 8. Eight, so that's one more. 14 and one more, so 15. And if we switch those around, we still get the same answer. 15 could be eight plus seven or seven plus eight. Same thing, still equals 15. Good job, let's try one more. Okay, eight and three more, so we have eight. Put that in your head, eight. And then three more, nine, 10, 11, right? So 11 is what three plus eight equals, or 11 is what, what? Eight, we put the eight first, see? Eight plus three. Eight plus three, or three plus eight, still gives us 11, 11. All done, all right, oh boy. Move numbers to complete each equation. All right, we're going to try that another day because I have 
another page for us to do. So I'm going to put you on hold for just a second. I'll be right back. Hey, okay, here we are back with some additional problems. So let's see. We've got two plus four more. How much? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. You're right. So I'm going to use my writing tool and see if I know how to use this. Oh, no, I don't seem to know how. <laughs> Try it again. Oops. Well, I have to learn how to use that. But 2 plus 4 equals 6. Right. Okay. Here we go. 2 plus 4 equals 6. All right. Now we have 4 and 6 more. Okay, we have four plus six more equals how many? Let's see, we have six, and then we bring up four more. One, two, three, four. How many is that? Ten, right? So I'm going to write down ten. All right, four plus eight, how many? Well, think about it. We have eight, and then we just need four more. So we start counting from what number from 8, 9, 10, 11, 12? Okay, and we write down 12. And try to remember them in your head so that you already know, so you don't have to keep counting all the time. Oh, and look, 8 plus 4, it's the same problem, only they flipped it around. So that answer we know is going to be the same. So that's going to be 12 also. All right. 7 plus 9. So we have 9. Let's add 7 more. 10, 11, 12, 13. Whoops, wait. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So that's going to be 16. So I'm going to write that down. That's a 1 and a 6. All right. 3 plus 4. Do you know what it is? Think about it. You have 4 and you add 3 more. Five, six, seven. it's seven. That's right, seven. Nine plus three more. I'm just going to put up three because I already know I have nine. Ten, eleven, twelve. That's going to be twelve. Good job. Good deal. Two plus five. We have five and we just add two more. How many? Seven. Right. Three plus two more. Three and two more. Five. Got it right. Good job. Three plus seven. We should always know what adds up to ten. And three plus seven always adds up to ten. So put that in your head. Three plus seven is ten. Three plus one more. You guys are pretty good when it's just one more. So I hope you know that that's four. Eight plus six. Remember six. And 6 is 12. And this is 2 more. 13, 14. Remember how we try to remember our doubles? And then we just add on from our doubles. 9 plus 9. How much? That's a double. It's 18. If you said 18, you're pretty smart. 5 plus 6. Well, we know 5 plus 5 is 10, right? So we, this is one more, because it's one more right here. It's not a five, it's a six. So that's one more. So you're right if the answer is 11. Okay, five plus eight. That always reminds me of Halloween, because it's, whoops, it is 13. 13, five plus eight is 13. Seven plus three, how much? That's a big 10, right? We need to know our 10s. Oh, and look, 5 plus 5 is 10, so this is 1 less than 10. So how much is that? You're right if you said 9. It sure is. It's 9. 2 plus 1 more. That's 3. 8 plus 3. Well, let's see. I know 8 plus 2 is 10, because I know my what adds up to 10. 8 plus 2 is 10, so this is one more, so this would be 11. Good job if you got it. 4 plus 1 more. 
You always know the one more is good job. That's five. And here, oh, look, six plus seven. Well, I know six plus six is 12. And this is just one more. So I know my answer is going to be 13. Well, remember, I miss you a lot. And I hope you're learning a lot. So you take care. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.